Patriots, welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Bonnie Gosain, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Wednesday, March 17th, 2021. Let's go to Aiden to see what's happening today in history. Thank you, Vani. Today in history on March 17th, 1919, American singer Nat King Cole was born. He was the first African American to host a television variety show, The Nat King and was widely noted for his voice. You may recognize his voice from some of his most famous hits such as Unforgettable and The Christmas Song. Ask your parents to play some Nat King Cole for you today. Now let's go to Chris for the sports highlight. Thank you, Aiden. Today's sports highlights are presented to you by the Patriots, the Florida Man Joggles Quad Cities Marathon. Completing a 26.2 mile marathon is hard enough. Now imagine running and juggling it backwards. That, believe it or not, is what Joe Salter did on the weekend of September 19th at the Quad Cities Marathon in Moline, Illinois. The Florida resident who completed the event in an impressive 5 hours, 51 minutes, and 25 seconds was hoping to set a new Guinness World Record for his feet. However, to qualify every minute of the event had to be recorded and since that is not allowed during some portions of the race, he was unable to stake his claim. This is not the first time Joe had brought his juggling skills to an already challenging event. In April 20, 2012, he became the first person in the world to juggle through a triathlon. Now let's go to Ana Alicia to see what's for lunch. Thank you, Chris. Today's lunch is cheesy penne bake, breadstick, mixed veggies, fresh pear, and milk. Bon appetit. Now let's go back to Vani. Patriots, join us tonight from 4 p.m. through 9 p.m. at Mod Pizza. It's our family night fundraiser. Scan the QR code to RSVP. Be sure to show your RSVP page at the register or mention the fundraiser so they will donate a portion of your purchase to support our school. Let's get together and have some great pizza for a great cause. Also, Patriots, today is our virtual read aloud with Pat the Patriot, How to Catch a Leprechaun, voiced by Mr. Santiago is on now. You can view it on RPTV YouTube channel. After you read the story, we'd love to see your ideas on trapping a leprechaun. Share your pictures of your leprechaun trap to pines.renaissance at gmail.com or upload them to the RPTV OneDrive. Finally, tomorrow will be a half day with dismissal at 1 p.m. At Friday is teacher's planning day so no school for us scholars. Now let's see what the weather's gonna be like today, David. Thank you, Vani. Today's weather in Pembroke Pines, Florida is forecast to be 86 degrees Fahrenheit and mostly sunny. Looks like a good day to enjoy the extra daylight we got from daylight savings time. Now let's go to Samuel for joke of the day. Thank you, Dean. And here's today's joke of the day. Why do people wear shamrocks on St. Patrick's Day? Thanks, Samuel. That was hilarious. Today's birthday girl is Sophia Gomez. Happy birthday. Now let's go back to Vani. Thank you, Solomon. Patriots, don't forget Pat's expectations. It represents present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Ian Denkwa, Miss Yearwood, Miss Kane, Miss Dry, Miss Maiden, Miss Kimbell, Miss Hendrickson, Miss Santori, Miss Newton, and Miss Samuel. You had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was, Three lives have I, gentle enough to soothe the skin, light enough to caress the sky, hard enough to crack rocks. What am I? The correct answer to the riddle was water. Now for today's riddle, I have a head but can't think. I have legs but can't walk. You use me every day more at night than in day. Again, I have a head but can't think. I have legs but can't walk. You use me every day more in the night than in the day. Teachers, please send your answers to pines at renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. 
Winners will be announced the following day. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a wonderful Wednesday, and don't forget to remember, reunite, rise. Have a great day!